Happy Friday. Friday. And welcome to a new vlog from California. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> San Marcos. To San Marcos. Say? Yeah. <laughs> Escondido or yes. Escombobulated. Escombobulated. <laughs> Escombobulated. Yeah. Man, we got our delivery done. We got Man, our delivery done. Quick in and out. We were there at like what seven? Ten minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. Yeah. Ten minutes. Yeah, we were there all. ten minutes. As soon as we delivered, we went and found a Costco and parked in their parking lot so I could get a nap. Yeah, I don't know if we told you guys, but when we were in Ohio, we actually got a Costco membership. We've been thinking about getting one for a while. We are tired of Walmart. And yeah, we went and got a membership at Costco. So yeah, yeah. yeah we'll be shopping there now. Yeah. So we went there. They got a big parking lot. They don't open till like ten thirty. Mm -hmm. So it, the parking lot was completely empty. And from what I've been told, Costco's pretty trucker friendly. Like, I've never heard of a Costco running truckers away. No, but And our friends that drive a straight truck got a Costco. And when they got their membership, they actually asked them about it. Yeah, right? yeah. I don't know if I parked there overnight, but. Yeah, especially not in California. At least during the day. So we got a nap there. Then we started getting some calls for some loads. And it looks like we may have a load over the weekend Fingers it's crossed. not something i really want to do <laughs> they're working on it they asked us what we would do it for we told them so they're getting with the customer to see if it's a go they seem desperate like they need it covered because they we told them no they keep bugging about it so we'll see if they and I think the price we gave them was a, was reasonable i still, think it was a reasonable price it, but, yeah but we'll see we'll see what happens <laughs> it's we're gonna have to take all the low bars, all the blankets, all uh, my shelf that I have built up in the front. All of that's gonna have to come out. Yeah, it's a 10,000 pound load and it's big stuff. So. It's really big stuff. There's it, like server racks or yeah, computer, computer racks server or racks or something like that. So yeah, we'll, have, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. We don't want to talk about it too much because we may not even get it. I don't want it. I don't want it. I wanted the weekend off. I really did. I want the money. It, <laughs> we hey, take the if money, we get it, we ain't get. getting those hooters either. I know. So hey, I look. It's another low for the week. Another it's low for money. the week. It is, but. I didn't want to do it. I wanted the weekend off. I wanted to tackle that air know, condition, make that run better. It, there's and, always something we have to do. Yeah. But money comes first. So money well, comes yeah. first. <laughs> we got to so take I, the loads we can get. Even though freight, I mean, gosh, a lot of stuff, we've got like, we got three calls today. Two three calls, calls yeah. I, I turned it down earlier and just said, yeah, no, I'm sorry. I don't want, I don't want to do all that. And they need it covered. They're desperate to get it covered. So we gave them uh, a price we couldn't refuse. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I look at it this way. You're asking what we're going to do it for. We're going to give you our price. I hate when they do that. Why don't you just say, Here, here's what it's, we could get, get you. I know. You know? Because <laughs> I never, I don't know. I, it, it's just me. I don't want to go too high and you be know, insulting, but yeah. it, I don't want to go too low and burn myself or. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we'll but, see. Like I said, we'll let you guys know. So now we're sitting right here waiting because he's calling the customer. and Yeah, we're going to go have Hooters for lunch. Yeah. We're right at a Hooters and yeah. he texts and so we're waiting to hear back from him. Yeah, so <laughs> I think we're going to get it. If they need it done that bad, I think we're going to get it. I mean, they seem to need it. We'll see. I think we're going to get it. <laughs> if we do, it's going to be a lot of work. It's going to be a Just lot of work. Just getting all the crap out. Well, okay. Yeah, the pallet jack might have to stay in there in the back, but we could probably put it on. Hopefully, they're on pallets. We don't know. They haven't told us, but all the blankets, all the low bars, every... We may even put the pallet jack up front because yeah. I'm wor I'm not worried about it, but uh, there's a weight distribution type of thing going on here. The truck, the axles can handle the weight, oh, yeah. but... I don't want too much hanging off the back. So right. we need to get as much all the way forward to the wall as possible. So everything has to come out. Yeah. yeah. And we got like 40 blankets. Oh my gosh. A no, lot we of blankets. just got all stacked up. We got all there. stacked up nice. And then I got <laughs> tool. And that shelf. And the containers oh. full of straps. And I got to take the screws out of the shelf to be able to take the shelf apart. Do we? We yeah. can't just no, it don't just come off. Oh, gosh. No. Yeah. Yeah, you got to take all the screws out. 
<laughs> we're gonna be doing we'll construction see. work we'll at the happens. dock I'm, I'm not even stressing about it right now yeah well let's see what happens let's see what happens we'll all keep right. you guys posted all right Saturday, do you? <laughs> oh my gosh. Man, what a putting week. Us, putting us to work. Oh my gosh. So the last clip we did, we told you we had talked to an agent about a load. Yeah. You want oh, to tell them what happened with that? That turned out to be a debacle in itself, you know. <laughs> um, I, like we said, we, we had been trying to get us to do it almost all day and finally we agreed to it and we were on our way to go get it and sure enough, the minute we accept, agreed to it, a and better there. and so we're heading oh, to go yeah. pick up a better load came across the Qualcomm. And we were like, oh my gosh. We were like, oh, but, but we have the double box. Right. So we called. So we called about it and told them what we were doing and that we were available if that would work for them, if we could run the two together. That would have been killer. But then no more than two minutes after that, the f first agent called in the low cancel. <laughs> and we were like, oh my gosh. So we called the other agent back and let him know, hey, we don't have that other low, so we're fully available. 100% Full, available for you if that other driver is, doesn't work for you. Yeah. And 15, 20 minutes later, they called back and that, I guess that other driver wouldn't have been able to get to the pickup in the time they needed and we were able to so, yeah, so we, got, we got the better load and so that worked out for us yay so we'll yeah. tell you about it we picked it up and we had a deadhead up to northern california yep. near sacramento yeah got it picked up this morning and we're heading to maryland 2740 loaded miles yeah two pieces at a whopping 35 pounds we we are gonna be <laughs> out of time oh my gosh our hours on our, on our hours of service yeah. because for those who don't know we're only allowed to drive so many hours in a week gosh i mean we're talking upwards of 6500 miles for the week i think i haven't I, know. I haven't added it up yet but we're probably pushing that pretty close to that yeah I, I can't remember the last time we had a week that we've had four loads in a week yeah and we're running out of hours i mean once we get we have just enough hours to get this one done just enough to get this mm -hmm. delivered Monday Monday at midnight, we'll start recapping and gaining hours back. Yeah. But yeah, we I have, only gained three hours though. I know I gained. And I then gained she 10. gained ten. But like Monday morning when I we deliver, I will have pretty much zero hours. Pretty left. much zero hours. And I will I be have... down to the crunch. Right now, <laughs> I have 24 hours remaining. And I think I have 28 hours, so. And, and 24 hours, that's two <sighs> 12-hour shifts. Yes, so we got a. We are going to be booking it on this load. We we hate driving 60, 70, 75. We, we hate doing it. We've actually had to do it all this week, though, yeah, too. Yeah, to make the deliveries. And to make deliveries work. and get done and I mean, get the next one. And we didn't have to, but it worked. worked. It worked. Yeah. It, you know, yeah. it, we were able to knock out that one delivery a day early, get that other delivery, get us down to California. Yeah. And it, if we wouldn't have done all that, chances are we wouldn't have got this load. Right. And what's funny, when we accepted this load, for some reason, Jason was thinking it was a city down south where we were. Oh, yeah. I was and we like, were oh. like, oh, we got some time. And then I looked it up. We went and ate Hooters for lunch. Yeah. And I was like, um, you do realize we have to deadhead five. 500 miles and he's like what <laughs> I was like, uh, he was delirious. I, I guess, was ready from, to get a good night's sleep last uh, night at a, wherever. And so 
So, but we were able to make it. Maybe we picked up at seven this morning, and we yeah. are we've all we are just got into Nevada. Actually, just got into Reno, Nevada. Yep. And I'm taking over. So hi, Matt and Dina. Uh, yeah, Matt and Dina. They live in Reno. Really, really good friends here. We have no here. time to. Or we would no, visit no, with them. No, no, it's all right. Yeah, <sighs> no, no time. We gone. <laughs> so I'm gonna finish making this coffee. Jump out. You can let the dogs out while I'm doing my pre-trip, and let's catch up with these guys later. We don't got no time to be wasting. No time at all. <laughs> And 67 miles I last night. I think he's fibbing on that. I'm adding adding miles to it or something. <laughs> you see, <laughs> that number. Happy Sunday, fun day. Happy Sunday. Is it Sunday? It, it is, is Sunday. Sunday. Golly, I was thinking fun it was day Saturday. Of driving. Man, we've been getting it. We've been getting it. We we're, got. We're in Iowa right now, by the way. Yeah, middle of Iowa somewhere no. past. But, uh, not middle of Iowa. We just got into. Oh Iowa, yeah, didn't we? yeah, yeah. <laughs> Des Moines is middle of Iowa. We just went through Omaha about an hour ago. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Whoa. We are getting it. Well, how many miles we got left total? Oh gosh, let me look. Under probably under our eleven hundred, because last I looked it was like right at twelve. Heather has seventeen hours and twenty four <laughs> minutes remaining on her clock. Yeah. Which have... she'll do twelve of that tonight. Today. Yeah. And then I have what I have 12, 12 hours, hours and 25 minutes 20 20 Basically something minutes one yeah one shift left <laughs> one shift left we so are, we are 1111 miles from the drop 11, right now 1111 miles so we should get there well, we, the bad part is we mm. have to slow down through uh Indiana and parts of Illinois but yeah. mostly Indiana because Indiana is 65 for trucks yeah um, but then when we get into Ohio at 70, but they got all those road works too. They do. Going across the 80, they got like a million road four, works yeah, or that they... you have to slow down to like 50 miles an yeah, hour. Yeah, one lane. Yeah. Our delivery appointment, not appointment, but our deli we have to deliver by four tomorrow, which will make that no problem. Yeah. And really yeah. the only reason we're really booking it is because we're so low on hours. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And she has to get as many out because... As long as she gets at least 600, that will leave me 500, and I can easily do that within a 12-hour shift. Yeah. But we have to get delivered. Then I'll be able to use uh, off-duty drive at least to get to the truck stop. So as soon yeah. as we deliver and we're offloaded, I'm putting off-duty uh, drive time, and then we'll drive to a truck stop. And yeah. What sucks is we'll, <coughs> like we start recapping hours Monday, but not until Monday at midnight. Yeah. And I think he only gets back like four, and I Three, get, but yeah. we might have already, I think we might have already said it in the last clip. <coughs> yeah, yeah, but yeah. Yeah. And it just makes sense to go ahead and do a, a 34 because yeah. we, if we do it right we can pick up a load tuesday afternoon because mm -hmm. then she'll start her shift to go pick it up and then i'll have my 34 by yeah. tuesday night when i take over so man we were adding up the miles because this is our fourth load for this week and oh we gosh. have done after once we're done with this load we'll have done seven thousand three hundred and like fifty four miles this week no, four miles. 7,304. That's right, yeah. 7, Not counting the 600 miles deadhead that we did. For the very first load. Yeah, from Colorado to, but then we did that miles and then we had the weekend off right. to go see Sioux Falls and stuff. So, but oh my God, 7,300 miles. And out of that 7,300 miles, there was only five mile deadhead, a 500 mile deadhead from the California, California to the, this one that we picked yeah, up. Yeah, this one so, right here. So. Man. Wow. <laughs> it's been a long time. I don't know that we've ever Actually, had Actually, 
oh, yeah, yeah, that yeah. we've done over 7,000 miles since we've been out here. Yeah, yeah, you don't get that often. No, man. Yeah. Crazy. <laughs> yeah. I, I know there's guys out there that do this every week. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of company drivers. I know teams that they just run them like that, 6,000 miles plus a week. No, I don't <laughs> want to do it. No, no. I'll do it every once in a while, but oh my gosh. And honestly, the only reason that we were able to do that many miles is because all of our loads, except this last one, we picked up right where we delivered. Right deliver. where we so delivered. It yep. was like, not, you know, pick up, deliver, pick up, deliver, pick up. We yep. weren't having to deadhead a bunch of miles to our next loads or yep. waiting yep. a day between loads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yep. yeah. We got lucky. Good there. job, driver. Good job, driver. What's up, yeah. man? Yeah. I think this is our record week with Landstar. I think if it's not our ever. record week since we've been out here. Yeah. Well, back when we were with Joe for a fleet owner, we had did like so good one week. <laughs> It, it, he had to pay us so much money that he had to do it in two direct deposits because the bank his, only allowed us. He only amount. yeah he had a limit on his direct deposit amount, <laughs> <laughs> so he had to send us two direct yeah, deposits. That was probably like in our second year. Or something, yeah, yeah, our maybe, second, second year second out. And, yeah, but I will. oh hush, yeah. don't be interrupting us, lady. Yeah, <laughs> but I am fixing to take over. He's gonna lay down. We're gonna end this one here. Cool. We got like, we just got a long day of driving to, to get to our delivery. And I'm going to bed. Bed. In the morning, go to bed right. so you can be up tonight and get us the rest of the way. Do it all again tonight. I think I'm filling up in uh, Illinois and then, and we'll, then and Youngstown, Youngstown, TA Morris, Illinois, and then Youngstown, and then that'll get us all the way there. Yeah. Yeah. So stay tuned. Next vlog we'll pick up after we deliver and see what happens this next week. Hopefully, we can get another good week. I don't know, with 4th of July Fourth coming of up. 4th of July coming up. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see. Fingers yeah. crossed. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys as always for watching and subscribing. And until our next video. Peace, love, and expediting. Better <laughs> <laughs> watch, I'll beat your fist up with my face.